You're watching Hawaii News Now with Stephanie Lum and Keahi Tucker. Well, more than 100 students had a lesson for lawmakers today. Help protect our planet. You have the power. Good, good for you. Governor Abercrombie shook hands, applauding their effort to raise awareness about clean energy. Wearing their We Have the Power Clean Energy t-shirts, the kids waved signs, urging lawmakers to pass House Bill 1520. That would allow residents to pay for the costs of installing energy alternatives, such as solar panels, over time, instead of all up front. Basically, it's no money down, and on your electricity bill, you'll pay it off over a few years. Um, so it makes it much more accessible for folks to do the right thing. We're probably going to see a lot of solar panels if they pass the bill, but if not, it's just going to be the same, and it's going to be bad, but it's going to be worse. It's not going to be the same. That bill is now in conference committee, and the governor has indicated he will sign it. If that happens, it'll be up to the Public Utilities Commission to work out the structure of the program. Also today, a California transportation company called Better Place today unveiled 10 new electric vehicle charging stations in Hawaii.